is too late now I remember you and me And how careless we yeah. be All day and all night We'd stay up, it felt so right We were so young, we were so dumb We would get drunk and then hook up We were okay, we were alright Staying awake till the sunrise We were in love, couldn't stop us Like a good drug, yeah. never run off. We'd hook up in my car, drive it so far Play your guitar, you'd show me your wrong Let down our guards, think with our hearts Stare at the stars, we were never apart Drinking too young, way too much fun Out in the sun, hoping when it's gone Took you to prom, dance to our song Dance all night long till the lights come on Now I remember everything And how careless we could be And how careless we could be Nights, long fights, it felt right We were alive, we would go out We were so loud, we were so proud We had no doubts Weekends and weekdays We'd spend our own way We were careless, we were fearless We were reckless, time was precious We love to waste time, whiskey and wine Drinking all night, asleep by your side Finally alive, we would just drive Never arrive, our journey was live Staying out late, testing our fate Running away, we live for today Young and so bold, never get old Screw what we're told, we can't be controlled Now I remember everything And how careless we could be And how careless we could be Mic test, mic test, mic test, mic test, mic test. Brrr.
Ouais. Ready? Breathe in, breathe out. And then. What is up, guys? It's Lunatic Prize, and welcome back to another live stream play of Danganronpa V3. In the previous episode, it's a sad, sad previous episode, but we had to move on. We need to investigate because Miu Iruma, the ultimate inventor, and probably my waifu since day one, is sad. <laughs> Oh god! Oh god, she's dead! Why? Why would she die? Leave me at me! <laughs> but anyways, there's nothing we can do. All we can do now is to investigate who killed Miyu Iruma. Kokichi is a little bit suspicious, but we don't know for sure. If you guys love my commentary, my gaming skills and everything, then definitely slap that like button! Feel free to use the live chat whatever you want. If you guys have questions, feel free to ask. I'll try my best to answer those questions. And also hit the subscribe button for more future gaming content. And also the bell. So you get notified about the latest, I don't know, videos. <laughs> oh god. Without further ado, let's continue where we left off. Oh god. Oh god, me you. <laughs> me you. Uh, what are you guys still doing here? What the fuck? Mommy. Mommy. He's dead. Oh god. He was hands with class around her neck. Scratch me for air. Her eyes are widening up in panic. She must have suffered quite a bit. The person who found me was Kibo, the, the first to log out. Said she still had a helmet on her head at the time. Hmm. What could have caused her to suffer like this? By the way, if you guys love my, if you guys also uh, love my voice acting and shit, then hit that like button. I don't know. Go for it. Oh, I'm a little bit feeling well, but it's good. What's the cause of her death? We don't know. Okay, so key boy, what did you do? Um, I'm been wondering. What is this secret of the outside world that we are searching for anyway? That's true. We got sidetracked by Mia's murder case. We, ne we never discovered what the secret actually was. We couldn't find anything in the chapel, and you found nothing in the mansion, right? Uh, okay. N no, Sumugi and I didn't find anything. My bad. I didn't. Uh, I didn't find anything either. That's probably the same with Kaita and Gonza too, right? right? And knowing then, if they had found something, they would have told us right away. Yeah. That's, that's, that's a little bit of a, I have a runny nose at the night. Ah, uh -huh. oh, excuse me. Bless you. <laughs> yeah, they would have, unlike you. Whoa. Whoa. Shuichi, did you hear that? R the robe as is being sassy right now. That's so mean. Do you know? Robots don't need warm blood to function, so they become cold like this. That's why he's more concerned about the secret of the outside world than poor Mew. Fucking heck. <laughs> he told us he couldn't cry even if he wanted to. He went so far to stage his Germanic reaction. That's not true. I'm hoping we can discover the truth too. You're a pretty advanced robot. You can be sassy and make excuses. Shut up, Kukichi. God, you're making him feel bad. Um, Maki, you're the second one who actually went out. Let's see what your thoughts are. Wow, I love your smart. I love your face, though. What's up? Maki was working on a computer. Her hands moving the mouse around rapidly. Um, you know how to work the computer, Maki? No. Nope, not really. I never used this program before either. Hmm. I see. I imagine that would do. Ah. <laughs> I imagine that would be difficult to understand unless you were an expert. Well. But I didn't find the text file regular regarding this program. It's an info. Of, oh, it's an info about the program basic features. But other than that, there's not much. Oh. oh. So what did you say? If you don't want to tell me, at least tell the Shuichi. According to this file, the killing game simulator used a certain program as a base. 
Let's go to New World Pro. Wow. Oh my god, that gun robot too. <laughs> oh god, the fucking. Oh. Damn, boy. <laughs> Dangan Rompa 2 is so real. I know this new world program. Oh, God. It's from Dangan Rompa 2. <laughs> oh, God. That brings back good memories. Well. It's a killing game simulator. Objects can't break. Your, body, your body's five senses are connected to your avatar, and your avatar cannot be harmed. But any damage inflicted in your avatar will be transferred in your body in the real world. That matches what Muse told us. True. If your avatar receives fatal damage, then your real body will die from shock. Huh? From shock? Oh. oh, this is the first time we're hearing about this. If someone receives a fatal injury in the vi virtual world, then they die in the real world. Well... You, your five senses are connected, so it makes sense you'd feel the same amount of pain. Right? So, it wouldn't be too surprising if you died from a fatal injury. Oh, but the more important question is... Why did Miru keep a, such an important detail a secret? That is strange. I have no idea why she wouldn't mention us an important detail. Did she hide it from us on purpose? Well, Okay, the rest of the virtual world is the same as the real world, including the laws of physics. Warps and special transportations like mounts do not exist. I see. So, you can only move around using your avatar. How she should have added warps and mounts to the virtual world. That's all I could say in this text file. Thank you, Thank you Maki. That was very helpful. Alright. But... but, is the info in the text file correct? What are you talking what do you mean? -uh. I'm not doubting you or anything, Maki, but I'm just saying the file couldn't be rewritten. It's possible someone rewrote the original info with false info, you know? But, but to determine that, you wouldn't need extensive knowledge of computers. It's my time to shine. Oh shit. Shut up. <laughs> oh, just like backlash this fucker right here. Okay. This looks like a job for me! Huh? What? Stop it. Don't get in our way. I won't get in the way! In fact, I want you to let me help to the investigation! Help in investigation? Monotaro! What are you saying? Hey. Come on, please! Won't let won't you let me find help me with this investigation? Ever since I've forgotten I'm bad with computers, I'm good with computers now. That logic doesn't make sense. You can't! Monotaro! We're not allowed to help the participants as mascots! We gotta stick to that rule! I don't care! I don't give a fuck about the rules! I wanna help everyone! I wanna avenge my dead mommy! Huh? Your mommy? You mean me? Not that! No! Monotaro! You forgot it again! You forgot that she's not our mother! I want you! And you forgot the most important person you need to protect! <laughs> Shut up, Peg! I'm busy avenging mommy's death! Yeah, how sad! But it looks like this is goodbye! I love you, but there's someone I need to protect! Goodbye! So long! Farewell! Aww, he left! She left! <laughs> Alright then. Uh, let's do it! Do what? I don't care either way. If you want to help, then that's fine. True, I suppose, but... Thanks. Thanks! I'll be- I'll do my best for mommy's sake! Alright, give me, give me a sec, guys. Um, 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 Right now, you're on the threshold of an amazing adventure. Showtime. One. Two. Um, yeah, so my freaking uh, video here is like lagging for some reason. I'm talking about the video on my other screen. There we go. There we go, there we go, there we go. Ah. Wait, perhaps we should... Who's <laughs> doing his best for his dead mommy? Ah, <laughs> I'm so touched! Wow! 
All right, fine. I'll leave it to you then. I suppose I have no choice. All right. All right. I'll start analyzing the computer right away. What? What is happening? Yeah! That's not analyzing. You're destroying the computer. What is wrong with you? Oh my god, you sick bastard. Why? Oh my god, you're destroying it. Shut up, you're like destroying it though. His hands are going at such an intense speed that the friction is creating fire. Is he actually doing some work? I've already analyzed, analyzed a few things. Alright. Alright, let's continue. Huh? Already? Okay. The text file is consistent with the original program. It doesn't look like it's altered. Yay! Also, I found this stuff. I told log uh oh oh it's actually a thing okay I told oh some interesting okay there's no sign that it was altered either it's be it's definitely accurate information hey did you show it to me what is this ooh so it's like a logbook okay okay well aside from me oh. Aside from me, everyone has logged in and out at once. You're right. It would appear that no one secretly logged out and logged in, logged back in. Then my my main concern becomes Haito. He logged out ahead of us. Oh, so oh, I see. Look at look at the time span here. It's like 5:17 in the morning, I think. And then I think it's around an hour. I think it's an hour of him logging out. Yeah, it's like more than an hour. No, it could be him. Alright, okay. So this is the logbook. Thank you very much. That's a good help. Um, also, there's something else I noticed while analyzing the program. Look at some parts of the program were rewritten. The program's been rewritten? Obviously. Mio was the only person capable of doing that. Hey. So, which files did she rewrite and what did she change? Alright, um sorry about that. Okay. I'll analyze I'll and I'll I'll, <laughs> I'll analyze that. But of course. Of course. But it's gonna take a little time. Well, as long as it's been done by the class trial, then Shuichi will be able to avenge Mio. Just say whatever. All right. All right. Then I'll keep on analyzing the crap out of this program. <laughs> That's true. Yeah, way more than you. Oh shit! All right, so Paito, where you been going, huh? That's right. Chuichi, I gotta explain. Hi, right. Chuichi, I gotta explain. Just so you didn't understood. Uh, um, explain what? Uh, You're talking about how you log out by yourself, right? Okay, let's hear it then. What? Well, why are you? Yeah. Feel free to lie, of course. Exposing lies is the real pleasure of this game, after all. Don't screw around. Huh? What? Hey. Kaito, just ignore him and talk to me, okay? I mean, about the whole logging out thing, I don't really get it myself. When I look, uh, when I was looking for the secret of the outside world on the rooftop, a circle lit up under me. I was suddenly sucked in, and before I knew it, I was locked out. The same thing happened when I used the phone on a log out. How did that happen on the rooftop? Uh, um, and what happened after you logged out? So... Everyone else is still logged in, but I didn't know if it's okay for me to log back in. So I just went back to my room and slept. Since it was dawn, I was pretty tired. Um... And the body discover announcement woke you? Yeah, did it woke you? Yeah, that's right. I heard it and rushed back here. Do you remember any conditions Mew body was in when you logged out? My bad. Nah, I didn't pay attention to that. 
so I didn't know. Mm, you didn't notice anything wrong? Like, what, whether she was dead or not? Like I said, I don't know! Okay, sorry. I just need to object to the contradiction of that testimony, right? I said I'm not lying! Tell him, Shuichi! Shuichi. No, Shuichi! In order to find out the truth, you can't be biased! Fucking heck. Alright, so Kaito's account has been there. God, Miyu, why? Gonta! Hey! Gonta, are you alright? You're so dumb. Are you de still depressed about Miyu? Come on, don't be such a Debbie Downer. By the way. Oh, Gonta, I wanna know what you think. Rare. I know, but who do you think is the culprit? Gonta don't know. Gonta don't know. Murder already happened when Gonta woke up. How this happened? But why this happened? Why me you killed? Gonta not understand. Gonta not understand anything. How could this be? But Gonta frustrated and sad. Gonta no could protect me you. He seems all over the place right now. Oh man, he can't think at all when he like this. It's true. Gonta, don't cry. Gonta, my big boy, don't cry. We will avenge whoever killed the freaking masochist. <laughs> Mayo, why? Mayo, I will avenge you, baby girl. Hey. Okay. Oh, don't talk to about him about that. I'm so disappointed to you, Gonta. When I first met you, I thought you'd be more useful. Sorry. Uh, sorry. Gonta, idiot. Gonta, sorry he no could protect Bayo. <laughs> Gonta, if you feel that about it, then stop blaming yourself. Help us find the culprit instead. This is the culprit's fault anyway. So pull yourself together and help us, okay? Okay. Gonta, understand. Gonta, do his best, Gonta, do his best to find culprit. Gonta. Definitely do his best this time. Yeah. All right. Okay, okay. Gonta, why are you smiling? Baby boy, don't, don't smile. Don't smile at the dead body. Why would you do this? Okay, uh, what should I, what should I check? What are those? What are these? What is this? A small bottle? I'm not gonna sit. It's a small bottle. I feel as though I've seen this before. Oh? This is yours, right, Trichi? Huh? Mine? Um... Nah, I guess it's not yours, but it's from your lab. Oh. You're right. This was the ultimate detective's lab. Right? Yeah, it was poison. Hmm. So you know about this, Kokichi? <laughs> of course, because I already checked it. We're all in the killing game, you know? If there's poison and tricks prepared, then of course I'd investigate them ASAP. That's... Is that? Ooh, it's not so I could use them. I could I check in case someone else used them. Oh, welcome Snowy Spy Zero Seven. Welcome to my stream. We're now in my investigation mode. We will find who killed my baby girl, Miyu Iruma. So if you got if you like my commentary, my suffering, and everything. Yeah, enjoy the stream and had fun. By the way. By the way, did you see that label in the back of the bottle? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Alright, let's continue. Label? According to the warning here, the po poison is pretty lethal. It becomes neutralized once it's mixed, so it has been taken directly. But when it was taken directly, the victim will immediately die, even if they only sip a bit. Which means it could only get in the victim's mouth open, so you could kill them instantly. I can't imagine a better method of killing someone who logged in. By the way, by the way, I should tell you the symptoms this poison cause. It causes a small blood vessel under the conjunctiva to explode, which makes the whites of your eyes turn bloody red. Hmm, is that how poison works? I mean, if technically. I honestly, I'm actually studying to like have this medical field and anything, and 
if that was poison work, then that could also be the thing. But there are like major symptoms, like uh, like literally major symptoms aside from that. But I think that's one of them. Go ahead. Well, that's everything about this poison. <laughs> Am I doing a good job? Maybe it's time to acknowledge me as your partner. I thought I remember you saying that you didn't want me to be a partner. Hmm? Did I? Well, sometimes I lie without thinking about it. Seriously? Anyway, who brought this poison? Do you think the culprit did it? Who brought this first poison? I can't be certain yet. We all sat. Wait a minute. Where did you find the bottle? Where did you find the bottle? It's on Go. It's on Kokichi's fucking chair. Oh, Kokichi, you're fucked up. Wait. It could. It's on Kokichi's chair though. Ah, Kokichi is a little bit sus right here. You motherfucker! I'm gonna kill you later. This is literally Kokichi's stair. I mean chair. I mean right beside it is freaking um. I mean my chair. It's literally my chair up the out the next part. Ah, you're building a bit sus, you little bastard. Okay, Samuki, so what you think? It ended up like this after all. I had a bad feeling ever since I thought I saw Mayu win Mayu from the dining room window. You, th you, you thought you saw Mayu? Yeah, I told Suichi about it. There's a small window in the dining room. Maybe 10 minutes ago, I looked through it. And I thought I saw Miyu. So we're gonna check the world, the other world. Oh, so you saw Miyu then. I thought I'd been mistaken since you should be in the chapel. You're only saying you were mistaken. So you don't have to feel as guilty. Huh? Because If, if you have been positive as Miyu, then you could have done something sooner. You could have prevented her death, you know. That's just speculations, Kokichi. You can't judge on hindsight. My dad. Oh? We went a little off topic there. Anyway, I wanted to ask you something. What did you do after you thought you saw me? Um, um I thought I was mistaken, but I really thought but it really bothered me so about ten minutes later I told Suichi and while we were talking about it. Holy shit, it's like it's like someone fell down a freaking stairs or something. Think Ah What What was that sound? It sounded as if someone was struck very hard. It came from outside, but Run! <laughs> Run Alright, so Okay, I'm gonna get my sex. Alright, so if you guys have questions feel free to ask don't bother okay he had the live chat all to yourselves don't be shy if you guys have something to say just say hi i don't know for now let's go outside and check oh no what it was kipo's voice right i me outside Oh, so Keyboy is sus as well. He wasn't at the chapel? Okay. He was, but Smoogie and I were positive of his voice. We heard Kibo from the entrance hall. We when he should have been at the chapel. What? That's weird! Cause you shouldn't be able to hear anything between the chapel and mansion. Even Mew said that. Yeah! Oh, yeah! Yeah, okay. Yeah! You can't hear anything while you're inside the map loading screen. Okay, it's like you're freaking voice acting shit. Not, I'm getting worse. You're right! That sound shouldn't reach through the map loading point! So, how did we hear Kibo's voice? How were we able to f hear Kibo at the mansion if he was at the chapel? Maybe someone's lying. What? Lying? Hey. By the way, Kokichi, did you hear the loud noise or Kibo's voice at all? Ah. Um, 
I'm not so sure. I must not notice because I was too busy searching. Kokichi, you let a little bit of sus right now. Oh my god. Kokichi, you're sus. I'm, I'm checking your damn mind right now. Welcome, Haruhi. What's with the freaking bread and cheese again? <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm craving for a sandwich, but no. We must continue what we investigate. So if you got if you like my commentary, my voice acting, everything, my suffering, then yeah, feel free to stay and have fun. Enjoy your stay. Okichi's always sus. No fucking shit, GM. Thanks for telling me the obvious. <laughs> hey Kaito, you kept interrupting me when I talk. Do you like me or something? Don't screw around. Who would like you, dumbass? I was interested in Suichi's conversation. You hear Kibo's voice when it shouldn't be possible. Can you tell me more about that? Well, what I said before was pretty much everything. After that, we headed back to the chapel to see what happened. Uh, um... Oh, whoa, well, agree. Yeah. We saw Gonta as we left the mansion, and the three of us went to the river together. That's when we meet up with Kokichi. Yeah. That's when we used the signboard that I found as a bridge. What about it? Did you notice anything? I suppose not. But... I see you're working hard. It looks like you're starting to take this game seriously, Kaito. Shut up! Shut up! All right. Oh, it's a Mugi. Tag is on. Nah. Is that all? Uh, let's talk to this bastard right here. Imiko! I never thought Mio would be killed. When I saw her avatar there, not moving, I thought maybe, but... That's right. You saw that Mio's avatar in the virtual world has stopped moving. Me, Kibo, and Maki all found her avatar. Can you tell me more about that? Any details? We were looking for the secret of the outside world at chapel. Mio was too, right? No. Mia volunteered to look around the outside of chapel, so she wasn't with us. Miu volunteered to look around the chapel? We searched, but we couldn't find anything. That's right. Then right when we were starting to get tired, all of a sudden we hear a really loud sound outside. Okay. Something must have hit the wall of the chapel really hard. We felt it all the way from inside. Something hitting at the chapel wall? We rushed outside to check the side of the chapel and we found Mia's avatar. Um, um, That's when you logged out to check Mia's real body, correct? But, but when we went to the river, the bridge was gone for some reason. Geez. Then while we were standing around wondering what to do, you guys showed up. Thank you. I see. Thank you. Oh. Alright then. Nice. Okay, so apparently maybe the maybe the maybe the murder scene happened at the chapel, not not at the freaking uh, mansion. I mean, her avatar was there. All right, so are we gonna check what's inside or something? Hmm. Are we gonna go ahead and see the world out there? Should probably go in the other side. Okay. Reds the conscious and blues the memory. It does not stop. Out of curiosity, what happens if we switch the chords? I don't know. I've never done it before. Probably gets all glitchy or something. Maybe become a vegetable. Maybe body swap for someone. Who knows? <laughs> well, typical answer. A glitch. So what's investigating like here? So what? What now? Okay. No, that might not actually be the crime scene. Yes, injuries in the virtual world could be fatal in the real world. Meaning there's a possibility that she was killed in the virtual world. Which means the next area to investigate should be... Oh, I see. The virtual world. We should go there again. Huh? huh? See? I just read your mind, didn't I? I did, right? 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 Sorry about that. That's the case. I'm coming with you too. Oh, oh great. It's coming. You must really like me. Yeah. Say whatever you want. I don't have time to waste on you. Yeah. 
If we go back to the virtual world, we'll find some new clues. It knows I might be able to clear my name. Um, May I join you as well? I also think we should investigate the virtual world again. Right. Why don't we all go? Yeah. Oh, so I get to be the avatar again? What? Huh? Did you actually like the avatar after all? Well, I'm going to stay here. He's still in the middle of analyzing the program. Mm. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> I drank a lot of Red Bull and then the caffeine is hitting me so hard. It's hitting me like a bitch. Yeah, I just said it. Got a problem? <laughs> Gunta, search this place some more. There's no time to be sleeping. Uh, that's not what we're... Well, that's fine. <laughs> I'll stay here too. What? Surprise? Are you gonna get lonely without your partner? My bad. But I'm busy too, you know? I have to watch Maki in case she tries to do anything deceitful. Huh? Huh? See? Well, you and Kai are pretty close. So you might do something deceitful for him, right? Hey, do you wanna good. die? <laughs> good thing Gonta's here with me. Your glare, glare is too scary to handle alone. Gonta would risk his life to protect me from a murderer. Huh? Hey! hey. If you keep saying if you keep saying mess up crap like that, I'm gonna kick your ass into orbit. All right already. It's fine. I'll just ignore him and hurry up to the freaking virtual world. Okay. Baka. <laughs> fine. Okay. Thank God. I don't like violence. The ultimate supreme leader would rather sneak around. So that means. Anyway, I'll leave the virtual world to you, Juichi. Could you just shut the fuck up and leave us be? You stink. Yeah. But I'm not exaggerating when I say this class trial can only be solved by you, okay? Your talent can save the useless people here, you know? Yeah! I'm also gonna save a useless supreme leader! Oh shit! Get wrecked! You son of a bitch! <laughs> oh god. Who you call it useless? I told you. Enough already. Oh. So we're going back to the other world, okay. All right, so one, two, three, four, five. So five of us are going back. Uh, so the red cord goes in the right side and the blue cord in the left, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, let's do that. Aura. Right is the hand I hold my chopsticks with. I gotta be sure to get it right. How did you mess that up for some reason, though? Don't don't mess up, uh, Himiko. There is no point of you messing up on this one. If you're that worried, why don't you use one that's already set up? Yeah, that's right. We place the device on our heads and switch. Flip the switch. <laughs> We're going to the virtual world. We're going to Sora Online. Just kidding, guys. <laughs> oh my god. Oh god. If you die in the game, you die in real life. I just realized, like, the Neo World program is. From the it's from the Danganronpa 2 game. I know I know that program to be fair. Great, huh? Oh, it's my avatar. Look, my avatar. Uh, I'm so delighted after all. You no. Know, so we're back here. 100%. Apparently, we always arrive in this room when we logged in. Mm. Mia said that logging in and out is impossible unless we're in this room. Huh? Then how did I get logged out? While well, I was on the rooftop. Okay. Then we need to investigate that area too. What should we do? First, we gotta go check Mew's avatar, right? That's right. I think her avatar is still near the chapel. Yeah. Then let's head out on the chapel. Oh wait, shit! And bro, no, my freaking voice acting sucks. Aren't you guys gonna appreciate this freaking uh avatar right here? Can you? Can you guys appreciate this for once? Like, it's cute. It's actually cute. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> like, it's like, uh, if you guys played, like, uh, a RuneScape. I, I play Ru No, no, not RuneScape. If you guys played, like, Harvest Moon, Harvest Moon, then it will be similar. I love it. It's cute. I, I love it. Comment down below who's the who's the cutest freaking avatar that you could see. Would be Samugi. I would be, I would prefer Samugi. But then again, it would be, um... But then again, it would be, uh, Miyu. 
No, I'm, I'm gonna say Samugi because I remember the last stream she like literally shake her head so freaking long. It's like it's like I'm dying of cuteness for some reason. Like no, no, don't kill me. No, left to right, move your head left to right. No. no. <laughs> Why am I reenacting this? What is wrong with me? <laughs> oh my god, that's actually funny though. <laughs> Uh, the, please forget please forget that i mean then again you guys won't ever forgetting it because i'm actually streaming it fucking heck this is bullshit oh god <laughs> shit okay i need to focus on reading i, I need uh less time chatting more time reading okay uh we found two maps uh pretty much useless maps to begin with <laughs> I understand. Looking at this map makes you feel calm, doesn't it? Huh? huh? Mm. You're, you're the type of kid who stares at maps alone instead of playing at recess, aren't you? Who does that? No. Uh, never. I never did anything like that. Shuichi. Don't forget we're here for you, bro. Bra! Indeed. You're not alone anymore. What are you guys... Fine. No need to withdraw it into a shell, you know? What is... I'm so proud of you. You made friends with real people, not maps. What is with this uh, sentimental shit? Why do you guys leave me though? Oh my god, look at this. It's cute. It's actually cute. Wait, we're we going up? The chapel. Okay, so we're going to the chapel. The chapel we go. Why are you there? Oh, Shuichi. Could you come? Could you, could you please come with me? What happened? What? What happened? I found something strange. I know if it's relevant in this case, but I want to hear your opinion regardless. If that's if it's right this way. Oh, good. A toilet roll. Thanks. You really are a good freaking investigator. I didn't know that toilet paper actually exists here. <laughs> that's right. It's cold here. Huh? Huh? What do you mean? My initial thought it could someone may have come here to defecate. No. Uh, no, I don't think that is. I don't think avatars have bowel movements. Freaking Kibo, your logic is so low. Oh my god, why would why would someone poop outside of the freaking mansion if there's a freaking bathroom in the inside mansion? Kibo, you have one job. Oh my god, for a, for a robot like you, you have so little common sense. Jesus Christ, man. Uh, wait. But Strange. Why would toilet paper be in a place like this? Could be related to the case. Toilet paper. Okay, so I'm gonna check that out later. Ah, uh, look at look at how they run. It's actually cute. <laughs> oh, fast, a smart boy. <laughs> oh shit! Hyper mentally. Oh shit! My freaking body. Oh god! Look at the look at the handshakes. Hey, isn't this a signboard that near through the river? Whoops, my hand slipped. You motherfucker. No. It's not the it's not some other signboard, right? They, she said there could all there's only one sub one of them. No. It's definitely the same. I brought back from the from blah, blah, <laughs> from the one that struck on the rock in the river. Oh god. Oh shit. <laughs> Oh, so that ha what happened? But, but there's something bothering me. The rocks on the signboard got caught up on the chapel side of the map. They're only this mansion side. What about the, what about that bothers you? It just got washed from the chapel to the mansion, right? From the chapel to the mansion. That's odd. The flow of the river. Oh wait a minute. Let's investigate the river for a sec. I just realized something. Alright, I need to follow the scenes. Give me a sec. Oh no. Hmm. Haito is right. The water is flowing to the right. So why is it the score? Why is the signboard at the other side? I mean. Wait a minute. Yeah, that's right. I just noticed something. Like, look at the look how the water flows. 
they are literally flowing to the right side. So why is it the signboard is right here? That's odd. That's really odd. I mean, I, I play retro games and I don't think that's possible. How the fuck did that happen? Pass the fuck, boy! Okay, so... It's somewhere here. Oh, look, they're here. What happened? Holy shit. The crime scene... The scene of the crime has not altered since I found it. So, so there's still possibility that someone tried to tamper with the crime scenes afterwards. Yeah, that's for sure. It's just like how we left it. I'm pretty confident in my memory. <laughs> what the fuck is that laugh? Holy shit, that's creepy. <laughs> I memorized a magic spell that would take a whole year just to chant. What? If you chant, if you think I'm lying, I could start the chant right now, you know? Unfortunately. No, no thanks. <laughs> oh shit. Give me a sec, guys. Uh, I just, I just got a chat on some bastard again. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna chat this person. Twenty. What day is today? It's twenty-seven. Oh, maybe she's. I'll let her do this thing. Right, let's go back. Okay. Okay, right, so let's let's investigate what the hell what the heck was. A log out avatar disappears, but if the real body dies, the avatar remains unchanged. Actually, look at this stuff. Uh, look at this stuff scattered around. What happened here? Jeez. That's what. Uh, that's what we're gonna start investigating right now. Is that right, Chuichi? Uh, okay. R right. What is it? A hammer? This is a hammer. <laughs> no shit. How'd you know? <laughs> uh, why, why would there be a hammer in this world? I mean, why not? I rewrote the program to delete all dangerous objects that could be used as a weapon. Oh? Mia said she deleted dangerous objects. I can't imagine she missed a hammer. Was Mia lying? Why would she lie? Hammer found. Found the cell phone. There are cell phones in this world, but what could they be for? No. Oh, that's right. It's a phone, so... Hmm, a cell phone. I can't... Uh, I can't believe there's something like this here. Perfect timing. I'd like you to help me without something. I just want to test something out. Come on, Help you out? Of course. Of course. I'll never say no to a favor from my sidekick. Yeah, that's what... That's... That's how my... That's... I don't, this is where I got my inspiration to become the ultimate. I don't know. Ouch, my freaking mic. Ow! Okay, my fellow apprentice, whoever you are. <laughs> if you're still there, say hi. Just kidding. Thank you. I mean, I can still see you. That's, yeah. You know, what do you want me to do? Right? You don't have to do anything. You just have to stand here. Mm -hmm. hmm? I just gotta stand here. Kaito Momoda. Logged out, just as I thought. This can be used to log out, just like the phone in the salon. And the pros that doesn't have to be a person themselves. They could just say their name. You can log out anyone like oh this. My. I see. Thanks to thanks to Kaido's help, I'm starting to pin this down. Ooh. I bet Kaito is pretty surprised when he logged out all of a sudden. I should apologize for that later. What is this? <laughs> okay, thank you, thank you. Hi. Hello there. What is that? It's a mysterious object. The floor mat. <laughs> With a mat, to be exact. It could be a common in bathrooms. I don't. I didn't see anything like that in the chapel. Where did it come from? Not in a chapel. Then why is it here? I just figured out the amount of magic. Huh? You did. Maybe someone used that instead of the signboard to cross the river. Oh my god, Imiko, that was a good idea. 
that someone is the culprit. No. That was a that was a lot. That was a good logic though. Thanks, Himiko. Oh my god. You actually did something for once. Oh my god, Himiko, you're not you're not useless anymore. <laughs> Alright, so where are we going? Are we going inside here? Is there more? Oh wait, it's Mia's body. Why would I ignore the body? <laughs> Oh god, Avatar makes sense for killing game. Avatar never showed injuries, so they stay the same. She's still almost alive. But her face is pretty. Her face is so pretty here, isn't it? It's hard to believe she's dead. Uh, okay. Y yeah. Mew's Avatar. Me. <laughs> You're so cute. Oh my god, it's so cute. The, the small goggles, the puny eyes. Actually cute. Okay, so anything else to investigate? Should I go inside here? Oh, fuck you! <laughs> okay, uh, you. What do you um, think? No. Just remember something. I think the whispering I, I overheard might be relevant to this case. Uh, you heard whispers? Yes. Yes. I didn't intend to eavesdrop, but I did hear it. Shortly before we gathered the chapel, I dispersed to begin the search. Wow, what happened? Oh, yeah. Before we split up, I want to ask something, Mew. Okay. It would seem Kokichi and Miyu had made plans to meet each other. Huh? Meet each other? Yes. Kokichi was confirming the specific place that we're supposed to meet. I couldn't hear the whole conversation, but I'm certain the rooftop was mentioned. Then... Okay. But it's strange. Right? If they were planning to meet at the mansion rooftop, why did Miyu volunteer to search the area around the chapel? You're right. That is true. If they were meeting on the roof, she should have wanted to search the mansion. Either way, she shouldn't have been able to get on the rooftop. She was searching the area at the chapel, which is where we found her avatar. And with no bridge to cross the river, she could have not have oh, <laughs> she could have not have gone to the chapel to the mansion. That's true. Something is strange about this. Okay. Ah, Kokichi is a little bit sus. The little fucker. Chuichi, since I finished investigating this place, yeah. There's something I wanted to ask. Can our avatars hide objects? Uh, it seems like you could put stuff in your clothes here too. Just like the real world. I see. Just like the real world. Eh? So what are we gonna do? Are we going back to the real world already? Uh, Before that, there's one place I have to investigate. The mansion rooftop. Alright. Okay, okay, okay. So we're actually gonna go there. Uh-huh. I don't really get it, but if you want to investigate, then let's do that, Tuichi. Yeah, you're right. Why are you guys so fast at running? Um, Tuichi, everyone's counting on you, including myself. Shuichi. Please give your class child everything you've got and see us through to the end. Why are you guys so nice to me all of a sudden? What did I do to deserve this? I feel a little bit of... Ooh, something is off as well. Why are you all being so nice to me? This is so weird though. Wait. You're right, the water actually just flows on the other side. On the right edge. Run! <laughs> You're freaking running. It's like fucking Sonic. <laughs> Alright. Hey, Chuichi! What was that all about? Sorry. Akaito, okay, I'm so sorry. I just wanted to see if you could log out using the cell phone. Then tell me first. That was bad for my heart. I suddenly got logged out. I panicked and rushed back here. Okay. Uh, sorry. Stop it. Come on now. That's enough. Don't interfere with the investigation. No. Hello there, Arisa. Welcome to my stream. Uh oh yeah. By the way, I'm gonna say I'm gonna apologize from yesterday's stream. Uh, we went somewhere and. Holy heck, I'm a little bit tired that time, so... Holy heck. <laughs> I was tired yesterday and I fell asleep. Sorry, and yeah. Uh, if you guys love my commentary, my voice acting, and my suffering and everything, then yeah, feel free to stay. I was actually wondering if there was a stream. Don't worry, there's always a stream. And also, I'm gonna stream tomorrow, uh, same time, uh, to catch up what's been wrong on the previous stream, okay? Want to investigate the rooftop next? Hmm? What's important about the rooftop? 
Was it near the chapel the whole time? We found her in the ground next to it. No, no, that's believing she will just reach It'll be okay. You mean she can do it for sure? She's the ultimate detective after all. Why is this? Why am I feeling such sentimental? Why am I being such a sentimental value all of a sudden? Something is up. Something is up. I can't. I can't feel my freaking guts. Shuichi is my sidekick and also Haruhi, my sidekick in the freaking game. Oh yeah, let's get it. Hey now, what are you, some credit stealing bully? I mean, well, I'm gonna investigate Mia's avatar since I got interrupted last time. Sorry. Sorry. Well then. Yeah. All right, let's go upstairs. Maybe they're all simps. Uh, shrimps. Sims or shrimps? I don't know. What what did I do to deserve this? I mean, I didn't do much. I pretty much blame all of you. I mean, technically you're all weirdos, so I'm gonna guess that you're all freaking murderers. Okay, okay. That's true. This area must have something to do with the case. Maybe this one. Oh, it opened up by itself. Okay, something must be here. Sorry, shrimp. A little different than I remembered. I feel like something is missing. Is there? Is there something missing? Hmm. Was it the mat? I mean, this is the mat right here, right? Well, this is a mat, though. Something is actually missing, though. I can't. I can't put my tongue on it. Okay. I can see in the past point of loading point. Something doesn't run right here. Who do we think it is? We don't know for sure. Let the investigation get underway. Hmm. Hmm. What's wrong, Yumiko? Okay. When murderers have in the mansion the snow like this, they always lock room mystery created by piled by snow. Isn't that right? But it is a po but there's a point that we can't leave footprints in the snow in this world. Is that something to be disappointed about? Um, Kyo, did you find anything? Hmm. This this is difficult. Uh, there's nothing here that seems to resemble clue. But Miu should be arranged a meeting with Kokichi here. I thought we could at least confirm whether or not she's really came to the rooftop. But unfortunately, there's no clues which indicate that. Did Miu ever come to the rooftop? That is an important question. Hey. hey, Kibo, I want your opinion on something. Do you think you could get up and down to the man roof of the mansion? Well, hmm, no. That would have been very difficult. The rooftop is rather high. Even the edge of the roof is roughly the height of the three or four story building. You're right. Oh, yeah, certainly too high to jump. Which means. It would have been impossible to climb up from the outside. That means the only way of this route is the stairs. The stairs. Uh, let's see. Hey. What's wrong, Samugi? The... Look at the doorknob. It's locked. Oh. Oh, right. It's a thumb turn lock. Easy to lock. It seems like you can't lock it unless you're outside. And look, the keyholes on the this side is the door. Is this supposed to be our way around? No. Not necessarily. I've seen this before. To prevent you from locking yourself out. Wait, did they just say Gonta is too high? I was long I was looking for a Sango Pearl. And then heard that. Gonta is so high? Where? I didn't I didn't I did, I did, I did not mention that. Did I? I don't know. I did not know. I don't know what I just said, I literally forget. Oh wait, by the way, I read that. No spoiling. If you know who did it, don't spoil. Don't ruin the game for me, girl. <laughs> or else I bet. Holy shit, what the fuck? What the fuck is wrong with you? I didn't... I don't re I don't recall saying it. Uh, maybe I just said it, but I didn't recognize it. What? What do you want? I told you. Monotaro finished analyzing the program, so we had told to gather everyone. A finish? We should probably head back then. Our investigation is pretty much done, right? Okay. Yeah, right. I investigate everything I needed to. Shuichi. Well then, we'll head back first. I don't wanna. I don't wanna. 
I don't want to say goodbye to my avatar. Maki. Did you really like it so much? Oh, by the way, Arisa. I mean, since you're into cute stuff, uh, could you at least share your thoughts about the freaking avatars right here? <laughs> Who's the cutest avatar? Was it Maki? Maki is actually cute too. Especially that small dimple on the freaking eye. Or a little bit of, pimp, uh, a little bit of a dark pimple, dark spot. Wow. You're Shuichi Saihara before you're the detective. Don't ever forget that. Huh. I shouldn't be talking. I threw away my identity as Maki Harukana as to be an assassin. Thank you. Thank you, assassin. Oh, it's so cute. Oh, it's so cute. Maki! Baby girl, come back! No! Miyu Iruma is my one and only baby girl. No one is actually gonna change my mind. Maki, I like her avatar. I think you call it the most. I mean, it, yeah, that's probably call it avatar anyways. We're gonna get Kaito, right? We're gonna go ahead and get Kaito. Let's go ahead and grab Kaito. Kaito! But Kaito is still on the other side. Are we going the other side? Oh, oh wait, Maki. It's just you and me. We should log out too. By the way, by the way, did something happen between you and Kaito? What? When he logged out a while ago, he looked like he was in a bad mood. I'm sorry. It was probably my fault. Maki is like Avatar. Okay. Ah, the Sangu Pearls are coming back. Uh, they usually just... I think they respawn like once a week. I don't know. Maybe two days, uh, two times. Yeah! They like, they... Uh, they spawn every two days. So, frack! <laughs> Why am I trying to say this? No, you know what? You know what? Fuck, shut up. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, maybe they spawn like in every two days. I don't know. That idiot is special. Simple. I'm sure he forgive you and stuff. So oh my god! Look at look at Maki. She's cute. She's actually cute. Oh my god! <laughs> I love cute stuff too. Oh my god. Okay, let's go. Uh, um... Hello. We shall teleport outside the world. Maki! Ah! Hello there, everyone. A device and the real world before me. Shuichi. Oh, Shuichi! Is it the real world way better than some virtual reality? Mm. Anyway, I feel so lonely with that around. So I apologize for making me feel unloved. Hey! hey there's something I wanted to ask you. Mm -hmm. huh? I totally didn't draw anything on your tummy while you were logged in, okay? Huh? What? It's a lie. I'm kidding. So, what is it you want to ask? Is that all right? You plan to meet me on the roof, right? Did you end up meeting her? Oh, you better tell me the truth. So you're, so you know about it. Yuichi, impressive, Mr. Ultimate Detective. Okay. And I'll tell you what happened. I never met up with Miyu. I couldn't get to the rooftop because it was locked. Huh? Locked? After I gave up and went back to the salon to search for the secret of the outside world. Is this true, Kogichi? Huh? You doubting me? That's... Can someone verify that you were at the salon the entire time? Did you meet anyone there? No, I don't have any witness. Aha! You son of a bitch! You killed freaking me, you! Right? But you can also say there is no witness. How can I prove I was there? Hey. Unless you saw the salon empty yourself. Anyway. Fuck you. Shuichi. Shuichi, we're partners. Which one is it? Did Yukichi meet up? Mew or not? Is he lying or telling the truth? Obviously he's lying! Who trusts that fucker in the first place? He did. Never trust freaking Kokichi. Damn it. Okay, so where are we going now? Okay, we're talking to this bastard right here. I've been waiting for you, Shuichi! <laughs> I'm sure Maki already told you, but I finally finished analyzing the program! Okay. I'm starting to put together a lot of information! Facts! Important facts! <laughs> ah, I, I, I misread that! So here they are! We try to be our friends, at least a bit. First, the person who tampered with this program was Mami! 
like we suspected. Mommy was so eccentric way of writing her code, so I knew it was her right away. I don't think it's Kokichi. Hmm. I guess he is. I mean, the more you, the more, the more you doubt, the most likely he is the one who started this problem. Got a minute. So what did she tamper with? Um, a few things, but I'll share the first one with you. So. It looks like mommy deleted a lot of objects on this killing game simulator. Okay, she said she deleted anything that could be used as a weapon. But in that case, why is there a helmet hammer? Okay. That's true. Only the hammer was left. But why is it left? Hmm? The way the program was written makes it seem like she did it on purpose. On purpose? Did she add anything? We found a cell phone in this uh, virtual world. Now, cell phones was an original feature in the program. That implies Miu hid the fact from us, which means... All Mami added was two maps. The rest was already part of the program. By the way, while we're take, talking about objects, I want to ask you something. We used the signboards across the river, but could we use something else as a bridge? Hmm, I didn't realize, see, I didn't really see anything that could be used as a bridge or across the river. So only the signboard could have been used as a bridge. So it was the next thing to tamper with. It looks like she tampered with certain parameters of the program. Huh? Parameters? Um, Maybe someone unsuspected. They probably want us to think it's Kokichi. No, it's probably Kokichi. He, he needs to die. Like, I don't care if, if this is... I don't care if he's the freaking murderer or not. I just want him dead. He should die. Of course, everyone's avatar is signed as a human parameter. But for some reason, mommy gave her avatar a non-human object parameter. What happens when you become an object? Well, the, dif the difference is only the identification purposes. So it probably didn't affect anything. But if it didn't affect anything, then why would she have gone out on her way to do that? Ah! ah. Perhaps that's something to do with the next thing she tampered with. So. Mommy added the wall that didn't originally exist in the program. A wall? Is she like Donald Trump or something? What is this? What the heck is this? The coordinates of the virtual world was represented as an X and Y axis. And it seems mommy added a wall that runs the length of the Y axis. Create an additional wall? Oh! So it's like the camera mount. It's like the camera mo monologue thing. Hey. But you're positive that's the only one. Okay. Yep, that's definitely the only one. What does that mean? Hmm. Which wall of the... Hmm. Oh wait, see, referring to the other two? That's strange. Also, it looks like an extra wall is given a special setting. A setting that allows non-human objects to pass through it. And allow objects through? I see, that's very interesting. I learned that X and Y axis recently. Oh, I know I know X and Y axis though. It's like the math thing. I and mean, I hate math. I swear to god, if there's like a math thing you have to pro propose here, that's gonna suck. Now, one of you guys also had a strange setting given to their avatar. Strange setting? Okay. Yeah. The setting made it made it so th uh, so they would be unable to move if Mani touched them. So if Mew touched them, their avatar would be paralyzed? Who was it? Ah, it was Kokichi. It's me? I didn't know that? Ah, Kokichi, you seem a little bit sus. Oh my god, you're you're gonna die. I'm gonna enjoy you dying, bitch. Okay, so thank you. Thanks a lot, Monotaro. Look at me! So, so cute! Miu! Alright, so I wonder what's the wall for. It like went all Donald Trump or something. I don't know. I should tell you this, too. Though it's probably not related to the case. 
Some sort of avatar uses an error occurred when you all log in the first time. Uh, um, error? Hmm. That concept of error unknown, so I can't provide any detail. But something strange definitely happened when someone's avatar when you all logged in. Well. I don't think anyone's avatar was acting strange though. What kind of error could it be? That's important information. Hmm. A certain error. Oh god. Oh god. Could you at least say something properly? Why are you laying like that? Hmm? Low energy? Me? No, no, I'm excited. Really? What the fuck is this problem? I'm just taking a little break right now. When I'm done, I'll be my usual energy. Why don't you just go die? Yep. What the fuck am I looking at? <laughs> hey! Oh god, the class trial. You're right. You can't. So. This is all I can do for you guys, but I don't want all any of you to forget. Uh. I'm your friend! Ah! Oh like I'm a fucking I'm like a freaking Chewbacca that time. Ah! <laughs> I just literally grunt in for no apparent reason. Huh? You just decided we're friends? Thank you. After everything you did to us, you guys, you just like literally accept. Are you, do you guys think that we're actually gonna accept him as a friend? What is this bullshit? So Mommy! Thanks. I'm going to test unsuspected, but I really don't believe it's him. I mean, Gonta. Gonta, my boy. Gonta's the boy. <laughs> I, of course, Gonta's a boy. Oh, God. Yeah, that's kind of a line that triggers a dead flag. Okay. I want to fresh start. I want to make up for the past mistakes. You killed three, four, five, six, seven fucking students. What the fuck, you stupid hey. idiot? I... Get out of here. Sorry. Jesus. Hmm? All right. You know, just chit chat. So long. Farewell. Get out. <laughs> Jesus. I don't need your problems. What did you say? I'm waving the wind. <laughs> oh this god. Going to do his best. Going to do his best too. Going to do his best to be even a little bit useful for everyone. Wow. I'm so excited. I will definitely expose the culprit in time. <laughs> what? I'm so excited about this. All right, it's time for the freaking. Uh, class trial. Fucking heck. So, what's gonna happen on this stream is I'm gonna do the class trial, and then I will end it on the half, half of half the sh half of the freaking trial. So that's what that's the going to be the plan. All right. So let's run. Fast as fuck, boy. All right. So. Uh, this will be like a full on no. Uh, what do you call this? This will be like a full on no spoilers ahead. So I'm just gonna ask everyone to refrain yourselves on saying anything at all except was during the uh, during the class trial. Uh, if you guys have any thought or something, just feel free to drop by. And any other, don't don't say anything, okay? I want everyone to at least stay quiet when it comes to the class trial, so that you guys, I guess, uh, you guys, I don't have to get spoiled, okay? Because yeah, that's gonna be a main problem, and I don't want to actually relate to that shit. Okay, so we're gonna run our way, making my way downtown, walking fast. I'm running fucking fast like fucking Sonic. <laughs> I am so sorry guys. I, I know I know I know a lot of you may be thinking that this guy is already cringing or like literally this guy already has a problem in the mental mind but no guys the, can't, bear with me <laughs> Oh Jesus Christ Ah yes the Statue of Liberty Why did I say the Statue of Liberty? Uh, um... Oh god 
unfortunately. Right. All right. Don't. Hey. That's so far. That's a fun quest shop. Okay. But... Might be okay. Maybe just another way to start the killing game. If we all die, then the killing game would end. Don't say stupid crap like that. It's poisonous if we all die. Okay. Well, we don't have to worry. We got the ultimate detective on our side. Okay. I'll do my best. All right. I have to say it. Ah, shit. I'm not. I'm not just saving my life. Everyone's life is on the line here. If I can't find the truth here, everyone will be sacrificed. I will not let that happen. Come on, man. Hey, Shuichi. You're getting all tense. Huh? What? I mean... Did I tell you before? Shuichi, don't care. Don't carry the burden all. Get it? And didn't I tell you before not to get in the way, Kaito? Huh? huh? What's your problem? You really don't get it. We're all relying on Shuichi to carry our asses though through this trash trial, right? You're like a parrot repeating the same lines over and over. You're bothering him. Well, you know. I think that's the most annoying thing you can do to Shuichi, you know? Huh? What do you mean? I'm not... Bukichi, you're annoying. Don't. Holy shit. Oh my god, Maki is on killing mode. Oh my god. She's actually scary. Holy shiz. Jeez. Finally, the pest, that pest is gone. Thanks, Maki Roll. <sighs> Just suck it up, Kaito. Now's not the time to be bickering with each other. Got it. Uh, my bad. Sorry. Um, Kaito, I'm okay. Hmm? Well, I know, I know what you wanted to say, Kaito. You don't have to worry. I believe in you. I see. In that case, I believe in you, and I won't say anything else. Shuichi. If you don't, have, if you have any problems, let me know. I'll help. I'm here to. I'm here for you, bro. The bromance is already real. Thank you. Thanks, Kaito. And we're going for the statue. Of course, the naked bear is gonna break the freaking cup. God, he's like wearing damn freaking boxers or something. It's like a freaking oh my god. <laughs> let's do it. Alright, let's go! Okay. Yeah. Eight of us got into the elevator. So behind us. Here we go. So it's time for the first half of the class trial. Let's go. And like all those times before, we descended. It's only a few of us left. It was dead quiet. The only sound I could hear was my beating of my heart into my ears. My body was trembling. The more I tried to control it, the bit worse, the worse it got. There's no way I got used to it. Really, the fear of death. We were, we were all fighting it. Trying to be courageous. We all felt through we were going through our own execution. No, not an execution. A test of our su will survive. Finally, the elevator stopped and the doors opened. And though, my, and though I couldn't explain it, my body stopped trembling. Welcome! Go ahead and stand all behind your open podium. Move your asses. You don't want to keep see what I'll do if you keep father waiting. Wait, is it back to normal? Why? Huh? You're not friend anymore? The jerks must feel pretty slick. Using more time's forgetfulness to befriend him. He just decided on his own. That's why we're friends. You bastards! You bastards! I won't let you guys drink water tower anymore! Cause he already forgot it! He may have forgot all his own daddy side! No! He forgot it, he forgot it! Oh, well, he forgot it, he forgot it, he... What? Shit! He forgot and forgotten that he's on daddy's side! There we go! Damn it! I couldn't... I could My tongue... The tongue twister is actually real! Really? I can't remember! I wonder if guy is the culprit, right? I can't believe the same room as a killer! <laughs> I can't. I'm gonna be let myself in the room. I'm gonna be inside of the barricade. I need a dead flag. 
Let's get started. Ice racing. We went to our podiums as always. We knew that we had to do. There's no protest left for us. It's already the fourth time. The fourth class trial was all about to begin. <laughs> Roma, the ultimate inventor. She may have given us a lot of trouble, but we all miss her. It was a tragedy after all. She helped me and Kaede with those cameras. Gave Kibo extra functions. In the end, she had done a lot for us. And the culprit that killed her. Uh, is one of us. I need to discover who did uh, who that is. In order to survive, I have to find the culprit, and I will fight for it. I will fight with truth and lies in this clash trial. Miyu, that was so. I'm um, actually crying. I'm actually tearing up for Miyu. I love her so much. <laughs> oh God, be you. Why? And with that, the investigation has now. No, the investigation is already Whoa. over. We're now going to our own class trial. As usual, we're gonna put our logic and action to the test. We're going on really difficult mode, like literally mean. We're going to that, and hopefully we can survive. Can can I actually win the game without uh, messing up or anything? You guys find out. Feel free to comment below if I could actually survive uh, a class trial. If I died here and then and I actually failed. <laughs> okay, so I I have five friendship. Obviously, I have no friendship in life, so I kind of suck. <laughs> Ouch, that literally hit. Okay, so I need to use something for us. High tension. Uh, attention gauge will increase at faster rate. Effective at. I don't know. I don't know this one. Okay, let's go check this one. Safety first. I know what safety first is. Power of life and dead. Make it easier to push the opponent back during blade lock. Um. Uh, uh, effective during rebuttal showdowns. Clear mind. Increase the amount of letter cubes. Okay, uh, I don't need. I don't need that. I don't think it has something to do with the uh, sneak peek. I don't want the hangman gambit. Uh, first strike. Uh, two sir, please be quiet. This. <laughs> I'm at the toys research thing. <laughs> We're not playing Genshin, goddammit <laughs> Uh, Saint Miko's ability silence all conversation except those who are to go on is this actually a useful I don't know I still don't have that much stuff delusions slowly recovers this little influence hmm. I don't have that much freaking stuff Increase maximum focus a little bit, effective during all class trials. Can't be combined with menacing focus. I don't have menacing focus. Increase maximum focus. Okay. I don't need maximum focus though. High tension? Hmm. Which one should I get? That's the big question. I think I should probably get this one because last time I actually did this, I had a hard time beating up freaking uh, Kyo on that last ending. So I'm pretty much gonna take this. I'm gonna set it, and I think. And then that's done. Class trial is at mean. Without further ado, ladies and gentlemen. Let the class try begin. The class trial is now in session. 
<laughs> now then, let's begin with the basic explanation. What is wrong with you? Oh shit, give me a sec, guys. Ah, screw it. This is tiresome. What is wrong with you, damn it? You need more motivation! No shit! I do. I really, really do. Now then, let's start this class trial. What is your problem? If you don't, if you're not interested, start, then shut I up! I just want to ask something since there's not a lot of us left. Okay, what's up? What happens if the votes result in two first places? Huh? You mean like a tie? It means they're both the black and as long as one of them is correct. That's fine. That's that's unfair! That's literally unfair. <laughs> what the fuck was that logic? That was so unfair. What the fuck was that logic about? Yeah, it's fine. Whatever. You son of a bitch! Thanks. Since that's answered, I can start enjoying this life or death game now. Oh, you son of a bitch. What game? How long are you gonna keep saying that? Yeah. Just ignore Kokichi. The rest of us need to work together to find the truth. Mm-hmm. Here. That's right, preach Himiko. Oh my, Himiko has become so determined. Oh yeah. It's true, people really do change. Yeah, that's right. But now she's lost what made her so unique. That's none of your business. Oh shit! All right, Himiko's on fire today. Let's go. We should focus on the class trial. First, we need to clarify. Kaito's the culprit. What? What? Say that to my face. Bullshit. While we were all still logged in, Kaito logged out alone, right? Okay. You weren't able to move freely. Doesn't that mean you could have committed the murder? That's impossible. There's no way I'm the culprit. Kaito, right? Kaito couldn't have killed you. That's right. That's right. Preach. How long are you gonna keep saying that? Trusted people can still kill, you know. Bullshit. Shut the fuck up. We already saw that a bunch of times. So many times. Since Kaede. You. Oh, God. Now you're low blowing my. Oh, God. I. 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 Do you want to fight? You want to go, bro? How dare you low blow me like that? You want to fight? You want to. I think. Let's. You know what? Fuck this class trial. Let's vote for this bastard. Let's kill him. The fact that Kaito was the only one logged out is suspicious. But he's not the culprit. He can't be. Alright, let's go. First non-stop debate. Start! Okay, what do we have? Kaito logged out first by himself. Okay. You were still logged in. Open fire! That's when you uh huh. No. No, 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 no. Okay. Uh huh. Yeah. was trying to pin the blame on me. That diversion was part of your plan, right, Kaito? Bullshit. It's not him. What do you mean, last words? Okay, so there's something to do with. Uh, her? The one with the highlighted yellow? Oh wait, uh, wrong button. Uh, let's see. What, what are my options? Okay. Okay, okay. I think it was the Monokuma's la uh, mo uh, Monokuma's pad. That diversion was part of your plan, right? Let's try. Let's check that out. Let's check that out. Okay, okay. I think it's something to do with. I mean, I think it's a Monokuma lab. I mean, Monokuma pad because they didn't mention. They didn't mention she was killed by poison, right? Okay, 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 okay. Let me check that out first. Okay, okay. 
The victim was discovered in the world. Estimated have died. No injuries can be found on the body. But what if it's Gunta? Hmm? Ah, Arisa. You're giving a, fla uh, a little bit of a red flag here. Arisa. Don't do it. Don't try to give me some hints. One sec. Sorry, I'm gonna have to remove that. Thank you. Hmm, that's something to do with. Uh... Okay, let's think of this carefully. So it didn't mention about. It didn't mention how she died. No injuries can be found, so that's not her. Here's corpse. That... At, at the, as the first to log out, Kibo was the first to discover. Hmm. Maybe it's Mew's corpse. Maybe it's Mew's corpse. But I need to look for the uh, thing. Okay. Mew was still logged in there. Uh huh. That's when you poisoned her, right, Kaido? I think it's not poison. Impossible. Of course it's impossible because I didn't do it. Maybe it's Mew's corpse. We found that bottle of poison on Kokichi's seat, didn't we? I think it was me. Mia's corpse. That diversion was part of your plan, right, Kaito? Well, Kaito. Hmm, give me a sec. Let me see. It has to be Mia's corpse. <clears throat> give me a sec. I got a text. <laughs> I am so sorry. Like. Don't worry, don't worry, I'll give me a sec. Mm. Alright, so let's go ahead and uh, investigate more. Let's try Mew's corpse for now. I'm guessing it was Mew's corpse. Uh, let me check again. I uh, was found grasping her neck with... She died with her eyes agony to her skin and body. Mm -hmm. I'm guessing it is Mew's corpse. Let's go ahead and do that. Okay, get ready, get ready. Uh-huh. Um... I got it! Holy shit! Did I got it right? Mew wasn't killed by poison, and the warning on the label proves it. Wait, did I did I just wait a minute? Hold on, did I give me a sec? Did I Oh my god, holy shit, I didn't know that. Did I What the fuck? I wait what <laughs> I was something oh my god what the fuck just happened I think I oh I think I shot the wrong uh bullet and then it worked I don't know what it was I was like literally checking on the freaking um the labels like I was like doubting if but I'm still doubting if uh I'm still doubting about my answer, so I'm I'm guessing I wouldn't try it. But I was like uh, going back and I clicked uh, while all of a sudden. What the fuck? That actually worked. What did I click though? Drinking the poison would result in subconjunctival hemorrhaging. Okay. Oh, so I think I picked the bottle. The uh, bottle. The poison bottle. In other words. Your eyes would be bloodshot. What the fuck was that? I didn't. I was like about to shoot it with freaking Mew's body, but I literally messed it up. And all of a sudden, I got it. What the fuck? Is that a guess? That was a lucky guess. I didn't expect that at all. Oh, but Mew's body. That's right. Her eyes weren't bloodshot. She wasn't killed by that poison. Uh huh. That's right. Then what was that poison for? Probably a diversion. The culprit wanted us to think Mew died by poison. Okay. 
Nah, you changed evidence, then hit that. I know! Like, I literally changed... I know I changed evidence. Like, I was trying to... I mean, like, check everything else. If there's, like, a certain idea that I, I could actually shoot. And I was, like, going back, and then I suddenly click Y. And it hit it! It actually hit it! Like, what the fuck just happened? <laughs> that was a mistake. That was a luck. That was a lucky shot. I didn't I didn't do it on purpose. I just didn't know at all. I was so confused. The real cause of death. That could be one thing. Um could it be Mio's corpse now? Oh shit, never mind. Damn it! Ouch! It hurts like a bitch! Oh my god, the freaking damage is one heart. Uh, what is the cause of Mew's death? Mm. Holy shit, how would I know? Um, no, 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 wait, 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 it's the killing game simulator. I, I mean, we found her body there, right? So it's gotta be that one. All right, let's go. Mew's cause of death was the killing game simulator itself. Okay, 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 good. In the virtual world, if your avatar takes fatal damage, your real body dies of shock. Oh yeah! Uh, freaking Maki told us before. That was made clear in the program's text file. That's right. Mew received fatal damage in the virtual world and died from that shock. Loud noise. Hmm... I think that's that would probably be the case. In that case, it's fair to say that the cause of death was actually the simulator. Yeah, that's right. I mean, we did we did heard a loud sound that time, so it's probably that one. Um, Gunta has question. Where is this virtual world place? What floor is it on? What the fuck, Gonta? Why would you not know this? If you don't understand, then don't say anything. <laughs> Oh shit! Maki's on fire! Put her out of wind water! <laughs> oh shit, girl! That's on fire! If Mew was killed in the virtual world, then the next thing we need to figure out is what caused her to incur fatal damage within the virtual world. I don't know. So her cause of death in the virtual world is the one that matters. Um... It seems like Gonta is confused, so why don't we review things a bit? Yeah, <laughs> Gonta. So, we split into two groups to find the secret of the outside world. Okay. The ones who searched the mansion were me, Shuichi, Samugi, Gonta, and... Kaito. That NPC Kaito. What the fuck is wrong with you? Call an NPC, you ASS. <laughs> and the others who searched the chapel were Keyboy, Maki, Himiko, and the late me. How could someone have given her fatal damage in that situation? Yeah. That's what we gotta think about. Now, let's all work together. Okay. Aww, little Himiko is all grown up. Too bad your chest hasn't grown up, though. Oh! Oh, shit! <laughs> oh, shots fired to every flat woman out there! <laughs> oh, shit! <laughs> oh, fuck! He's on fire! <laughs> More fire for this bastard! This is why he deserves to die! Oh, my God. That was uncalled for! Someday, my chest will grow like crazy! What the fuck is wrong with you? Why are you agreeing to this shit? Let's begin then. The fatal damage that Mio received in the virtual world. Let's pin that down. All right, let's let's see what we have here. Okay, okay. Monokuma file, small bottle, Mio's core, sign of the board, hammer. The could, could it be the hammer? Let's check the hammer. Let's focus our efforts on that first. All right. Okay. Okay. It has to be the hammer. It could be. We're going to beat her with his bare hands. 
I don't think so. I think strangulation is more likely. Oh? It's possible she was pushed from a great height. Oh my god. Could she have drowned? Um, I don't think so. Hmm. What could be the cause of death? The virtual... Okay, so what we found is a hammer. But then again... Uh... Hmm. Let's check on the loud noise. There's something to do with the loud noise, I guess. Well, Shuichi and Sumugi were in the mansion kitchen of the virtual world. They heard a loud sound. I uh, saw so something crash into something else. So maybe she was hit by a hammer. No, no, no. No, maybe not. Maybe not. Because it couldn't be the hammer. Because if it's the hammer, then it would be loud as heck. And, it, and if it's... And if it's somewhere on the chapel, then it couldn't be heard from the mansion. It should be not be heard on the mansion. So I'm guessing the hammer is not live over this one. But then again, this is something else right here. Hmm. What else do we have? Monokuma file, small bottle, Muse ports. Um, signboard uses a bridge, hammer, cell phone. Okay. It has to be the hammer. We're going to beat her with his bare hands. Mm, I don't think so. Are we certain that blunt force was involved? Mm -hmm. I think strangulation is more likely. Hmm. It's possible she was pushed from. A I mean, I think Maki has a point there because. The way uh, Mia was positioned while dying, it's like literally she was ch getting choked, right? It was like literally cho get getting choked by something else. But if she died in the real world, then what would be the bullet for that? Could be relating, relating to Mia's corpse? It could be. It could be Mia's corpse. But the big question is, which one? Mia was found grasping her neck with both eyes. She died with eyes open and her expression of agony on her face. Hmm. I mean that's I mean that's a logical answer because when you're like strangling someone, they usually uh, panic. They usually panic a lot, and then li like at her at his or her final breath, like uh, their expression are like so panicked, like they couldn't. Uh, do much uh, their eyes are open dead as sick uh, So lesson thing. I think I think that's actually the Mew's corpse. So let's go with Maki's idea Okay, 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 okay. All right, so we're doing some awesome uh, work here. So we're actually understanding we're now getting used with this investigation So let's go ahead and do that Okay Okay Okay. No, I don't think so. We're going to beat her with his bare hands. No, 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 no. Are we certain that blunt force was involved? Okay. I think strangulation is more likely. Maya! All right. Let's go, Maki. Good work. Good invest. Uh, good debate there. Let's go. Let's go. His body showed severe trauma and signs of a struggle. That's right. Okay. If her body experienced pain, she must have been in pain in the virtual world as well. That's right. Knowing that, I believe Maki is correct. He was strangled to death. That's right. Yeah, definitely. That's right. Good idea, Maki. Strangling and poison are the only methods that can make her look like she suffered. Mm -hmm. But we already removed the possibility of poison. So it can only be strangulation. Good, good idea. Also, when a victim is poisoned, they commonly grab their chest or mouth. Okay. But Mew was holding her throat. It's obvious she was trying to protect her windpipe. Oh, the assassin master gets really chatty when it comes to corpses. That's kind of weird, though. How do you how do you get strangled in the game? Is that even possible? 
Oh. Oh. Uh, oh. Maki is pissed. Holy shit, Maki is pissed. In that case, her exact cause of death is being strangled in the virtual world. But is strangulation even possible in the virtual world? That's the thing. That's that's what that's what I'm asking. Is it even possible? If the avatars were equally strong, it would be difficult to strangle a resisting victim. Mm hmm Yeah, if she was just as strong as them, no way they could have strangled her. Uh-huh. Then the culprit would need a tool. All right. There are tons of cases where a weaker person would strangle a stronger person with a rope. Uh-huh. Wow, you know a lot about killing. No. Oh! Holy shit, she's actually pissed again, okay. But was there even a rope in that world? I don't remember seeing one. Then they must have used something else as a rope. Something as a rope? Might have idea. Was it the hammer? It was the hammer, right? It could be the hammer. Let's go with it. Oh, wait, something. Something like a rope would be long and wind up. To Thanks, Captain Obvious. That's totally unclassified a hint. I was wrong. Ouch! No, it's not the hammer. What else, though? Is it the toilet paper? No way. This is it. No fucking way. Are you serious? During the investigation, we found toilet paper outside the mansion. Oh yeah, that's right. Because objects can't break in that world. Oh, so that's the purpose of the toilet paper. What the fuck? I just, I like literally realized that like. She did mention that objects there are are unbreakable. She told she told it during that time we we're doing the bridge thing. Gonta, no can ignore that. Uh, what? Gonta, wait, what? Gonta, what? What you mean, Shurichi? Huh? What's wrong? What's wrong, Gonta? What's wrong? Shuichi goofing off. Not gentlemanly at all. Oh, uh, Gonta. Uh, how? I mean, they they did mention. Uh, Himiko did mention it's like a rope, and since objects aren't unbreakable that time, the tissue papers aren't aren't like usable. They're like foreign objects. Uh, wait, what? Are we fighting Gonta? Oh my God, it's a demon! Wait, what? What am I gonna use? Toilet paper? No time for nonsense. Gonta, what are you no doing? Toilet paper. Huh? Place of rope. Huh? How did I miss easy. that? Even Gonta know that, and Gonta not smart. No oh wait, 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 wait! It is the toilet paper. No toilet paper. In place of rope. Tear too easy. No, I, I fucking missed. I fucking missed. You son of a bitch. Damn it. I fucking missed. There's no time for nonsense. Help, help. No can use toilet paper in place of rope. Shut up. Tear too easy. What? What am I missing? Am I missing or am I using the wrong one? What the fuck is happening? No, I think Gonta's logic is actually uh, so hot, so low because I think he's trying to think that go the freaking toilet tissue won't, will actually break. I think that's the that's the thing. That's the thing. I think that's the, that's his logic. Give me a sec. Oh my God, Gonta is killing me! Help! Oh my God, shit! No what else? No can use toilet paper. What am I gonna in use? What tear too easy? Even Gonta know that, and Gonta not smart. No, I'm positive toilet paper was used instead of rope. You died such an awful death. 
why you not take this seriously? Why did I miss that? Shut up, Gunta! Use your head! Yeah? Oh wait, no, no, no. You're out. Real murder weapon. What? Why am I missing? You died such an awful death. So why you not take this seriously? The controllers are being attacked. Why am I missing? Detective, use your head. You're out. Real murder weapon. Okay, okay. No, I'm positive toilet paper was Use the things that up. mentions about the unbreakable inside the it's game. No time for nonsense. No can use toilet paper. I I think it's this In one. Place of rope. In place of rope! <laughs> I like this. Would tear too easy. No 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 no! There we go! Got him! I knew it! That's because of the logic of the world! God damn it! That's right! Because in the virtual world, objects are unbreakable. Mm-hmm. <laughs> You're so dumb, Gonta. You didn't even know that? Fuck you. Objects can't break in that world, and toilet paper shouldn't be able to tear. That's right. And since it couldn't tear, it could be used as a rope. Okay. Gonta not really understand, but... Sorry, Shuichi. Gonta was wrong. Gonta was wrong. It's all right, Gonta. People make mistakes, except for one certain person that I really, really, really hate. Yeah, I'm talking to you, damn Kokichi. Why would you be a little dick sometimes? Jesus Christ. Give me a second. Ouch. Oh, shit. I'm bleeding. Just kidding. It's okay, Gonta. Don't worry about it. Killed by toilet paper. It was a fitting end for her. <laughs> Wow, even when she's dead, she's still putting fire on that corpse. Wow, Himiko, that's savage. <laughs> oh, my, a fitting end for her. You piece of shit. <laughs> oh my god, that was savage. I do not fully understand that logic. That was savage as fuck. But if Mio was killed near the chapel, why was the murder weapon by the mansion? Oh yeah, that's right. Why, why is she dead? Why is she dead over there? Maybe the culprit tried to get rid of it to destroy the evidence. Maybe. The culprit, uh, if the culprit meant to get rid of the evidence, they did a poor job of it. Oh shit, even to which is making like fucking fire statements. There's a much better place where they could destroy it. If toilet paper was the murder weapon, then what's the deal with the hammer next to her? Hmm. Perhaps the culprit prepared a backup weapon, just in case. Yeah. No, the culprit didn't bring the hammer. Oh? Do you think so? No? But who else but the culprit would bring a hammer? Wait, we already knew who brought the hammer. It's Miyu! It's either Miyu or Hokichi. It probably me. It's probably me because she's beside it. That's it. It's obviously logic. It's an obvious logic. Mew was the one who brought the hammer. Yeah. Mew bring hammer. Remember what she told us. Okay. I rewrote the program to delete all dangerous weapons that it could be used as weapons. No objects as weapons. What the fuck? Why did I not read that yeah, before? She did say she deleted any dangerous objects. If that were true, she wouldn't have missed something like a hammer. Mm -hmm. Meaning that Mew must have left it on purpose. On purpose? But why she do that? Yeah, why? Mew brought the hammer for sure, but what did she need it for? Need to make that clear. All right, let's rumble. Non-stop debate. Let's go. Let's assume that Mew brought the hammer. Uh huh. What was she planning to do? Okay. Maybe use it to break down a wall. I don't think so. Uses for a hammer. Don't know. Mew gonna build stuff with hammer. Probably just brought it for self-defense. Oh, probably. Secretly met up with someone. Uh -huh. And tried to kill them with it. You idiot! She was the victim. 
Oh wait, 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 wait. I think she I think Kokichi is somehow right. It's because of the evidence. There's an evidence here. There's an what evidence is... here. Let's see. What are my choices? Oh uh, no no, there's no choices. Let me see if it's there though. Um This one. Found frozen and collapsed in the snow between the chapel and the wall where the virtual world ends. When the user logs out, their avatars disappear, but the you but if the user real body dies, the avatar stays in the virtual world. This avatar does die, nah, 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 nah. Uh, everything in the killing game similar to blah, 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 blah. No, it's not that one. This one, this one, this could be one, this could be one. Um let, let's see, let's see here. Uh while everyone is gathering, Mia told Kokichi to meet her at the rooftop of the mansion. However, when everyone else decided how to split up the secret, we volunteered to search the chapel. It could be this one. It could be this one. Assume that you brought the hand. Kokichi knows. Kokichi knows it. Maybe use it to break down a wall. Uses for hammer. Uses for Don't hammer. You know, gonna build stuff with hammer. Bob the Builder. Fire! There you go. Well, he's honest for once. You little shit. You was gonna meet up with someone in the virtual world. That's right. Mm-hmm. With me. I was supposed to meet up with Mew on the roof of the mansion. What? Is that true? I overheard them talking about it at the chapel. By the way, Mew asked to meet up with me before we went into the virtual world. Okay. I totally forgot where we were supposed to meet, so good thing Keyboy spied on us. You son of a dirt! Wait, so Mew called Kokichi out? If Mew brought the hammer, I wonder what she was planning to do with it. Oh, she's gonna kill you. She's gonna kill you. Kill Kokichi. That's it. That's obviously the thing. What would you need a hammer she was for? Trying to kill Kokichi. That's right. She was what? Yep. She plotted to meet up with me and then kill me with the hammer. If you right. want to prove this, you'll need to figure out Mew's plan. Okay. Okay. Mew's plan, huh? I'm sure if I analyze the clue we found, I could figure something out. Alright, let's do it. Oh no! Oh no! Let's drive! We're driving! Alright, so let's go, let's go. Let's let's see what we could we would know. What would we know? Okay. Oh god, this is where I get my driver's license for once. Are those two cars? Oh shit. Oh shit. Miss me, bitch! <laughs> Alright. Okay. Why are there like two cars now? Where did this all come from? One more, one more, one more. Um, uh, Let's drive, boy! All right, who tried to kill Kokichi? It's me. It's gotta be me. Come on, come on. Increase your speed more. Uh, it's me. Mia is trying to kill Kokichi. Oh, we're going fast, boys. Oh, oh, wait a minute. Is that... Oh, no, 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 wrong one. Shit, I was about to... What about this one? Okay. This is where I learned my driver's license. I should probably get my driver's license soon. And I'm gonna tell them on my application. I learned how to drive in a video game. I, I, I'm guessing they're gonna accept that, but... I don't know for you guys. Ah, fuck, I missed. This is where I learn. I want to be the best driver there was. This is not a bumper car. Oh my god, why are there so many cars now? What are their problem? Can't they tell that I'm driving? Fucking heck. Oh no, oh no, 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 no. Fuck you. <laughs> okay, okay. Uh. Oh shit, I'm, I'm hitting the wall. Okay, thinking time, thinking time, thinking time, thinking time. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Where was me trying to kill Gokichi? Uh, the virtual world, duh. 
What is... They're still there. They're still inside the freaking game. Okay, okay. So we need to move as easy. Next question. Oh shit, I thought there's a car in front of me. Okay, so move here. Is that Samugi? Holy shit, look at Samugi! Ah oh, shit, I fucking bumped into the freaking wall! Oh shit! No! Fucking heck, why am I not listening? Oh god! Oh, there goes my license. Why Why am I not listening? Focus, Price! Focus! You're driving for god's sakes! Don't look at fucking boobs! <laughs> ah, wall! Fucking heck, why are there so many obstacles? In the real world, this won't happen! Don't, don't freaking breathe and drive! I repeat, don't breathe and fucking drive! Fucking heck, man! Why is this happening? We're losing momentum, we're losing time, we're losing everything! Everyone's dying, you know? But fucking heck, Sumugi's billboard is distracting me! <laughs> oh god, oh god! Why are there so many cars? I don't get it! Is that how driving works? Are there supposed to be cars? Are there supposed to be at least two or three? Oh fuck, I missed them all. Are there at least supposed to be two or three of them? No! Okay. Oh, there we go. Alright, so... Which one? No! What am I shit? What am I driving? Holy shit! Why is the bottle... Divert? Di Maki already told the freaking plan! Maki already told us. Alright, let's go. Lesson learned. Don't read and don't read and chat. At the same time. Place the poison on my seat to make us think the murder happened in the real world. Okay. You did that too? What? Mew was the one who put that poison bottle there? Uh-huh. No, that ain't right. Something's definitely weird about that. Why? I think it I think it is because she's the last one who came out. I came in. Uh yeah, yeah, there we go. The login, the login, the login records. If she did place the poison without us noticing, I think I I think I remembered because I mean there it is. The freaking the freaking stuff is over there. Mew is the rock Mew is the one who logged in last. And it took like two minutes to actually do it. So it's her. Okay, let's go. And then what? Log back in? No! Kokichi, weren't you in the salon around that time? Did you see her log in or log out at all? Nope, I didn't see that at all. If she hadn't logged in or out, then you couldn't have placed the voice. Then who put poison bottle? Uh, where should I shoot it? No, it's not that. Kaito, your grave just got ten feet deeper. Fuck you. No, it wasn't me, guys. There's a poison on the planet. We're determined. When I think when Kaito poison? said something. I think that's the one. Place the poison without us noticing. Okay. Okay. Then you couldn't have placed the poison. Fire! Alright, let's go! My logic thinking is increasing every day. I'm studying too, you know. <laughs> it was Mew who planted the poison on Kokichi's chair. Alright. She had plenty of time to do it. Here, take a look at this. Okay. Is this? You see, it's over there. Like Miu has two minutes to actually log in. That's right. It says that Miu was the last of us to log in. Yep, that's right. That's right. That's right, GM. You did well. You did something for once. <laughs> she logged in last. She would have had time to move around in the real world after the Yeah, she had like literally two minutes to actually do it. That's a lot of time already. Right. She could have placed poison bottle on Kokiji's seat. That's right. This was all part of Mew's plan. Uh-huh. She tried to kill me in the virtual world, 
make us think it happened in the real world, mm -hmm. then pin the crime on Kaito. But why Kaito again? Oh, that's not my fault. But why Kaito again? That's why she manually logged you out just for that purpose. What do you mean? So she did that to me? Yes, I'm positive of that. Mew used a method only she could use to log Kaito out manually. Is it? Oh, it's the phone. It's the phone. It's the phone. Where is it? It's the freaking phone. This is it. There we go. We're doing Mew's well, boys. Cell phone found by Mew's avatar. That cell phone worked the same way as the phone in the salon. Mm -hmm. It logs users in and out. Uh huh. I verified this myself when I spoke Kaito's name into it. Uh-huh. Uh, Kaito Momoda. And <laughs> disappeared. The, the way he disappeared is like... With that shit. cell phone, Jeez. she can force anyone to log out at any time. All right. But you never mentioned the cell phone, right? Uh-huh. That's what Shuichi referred to when he mentioned a method only she could use. Mm -hmm. She kept the cell phone a secret on purpose so she could use it for the murder. Okay. So, she really was planning a murder. There is a murder among yeah. us. She tried to set me up. Well, I knew that from the start. Bullshit. Then why did you say I was the culprit? Yeah, that's right. Why did you? Because I wanted to get it through your thick skull. You want to fight? People you trust and defend will ultimately betray you. This is a game of suspicion. Oh? Asshole? Well, I think your ideals should stay the same. Because phonies like you are what make the game more interesting. You want to die? Don't you agree, Monokuma? You motherfucker. Mm -hmm. Do I? I don't know about that. Why are you so sleepy? Huh? Oh, wait. What were we talking about? What is, what is happening here? I know, what the heck is happening? Yeah. If father keeps slacking off, all the work is gonna get forced onto mommy. What is happening? My head. I feel like I'm about to remember something, but I can't. What's wrong, Monotaro? Pull yourself together! Among us! Anywho, it's a blessing in disguise that Mew died and not me. What you mean? What you mean? You wouldn't have said anything about what really happened in the virtual world. You guys would have had a way harder time finding the culprit, you know. Mm -hmm. She would have been able to lie about the virtual world settings as much as she wanted. Uh -huh. And you'd never know that the murder actually took place in the virtual world. Mm -hmm. So that's why she decided to attempt a murder. Because she had total control. That's right. And the reason Mew was so insistent we go into the virtual world was... <laughs> You guys are only bitching because you haven't been to the virtual world yet. But once you go, you'll understand. Seriously, it's so fucking awesome. I know you guys will love it. And then you're gonna fall in love with me for showing it to you guys. So, let's just dive right in, okay? We'll do it together. She was insistent we go there so she could kill us. What a shady person. She's dead. I was sad that she was gone, but now I don't know what to think. <laughs> nice! Backstabbed by a trusted friend. See? That's an ideal fun situation. Now we can start a real class trial. Oh, God. Kokichi sort of sound like Monokuma. Hmm? Really? I don't sound anything like him. No. You're just like Monokuma. Both of you are cowards. You never speak the truth or show your true face. Oh. Wait, coward? You say some interesting things sometimes, Kaito. Smiling, putting on a mask, never saying what you really think. Mm -hmm. That kind of cowardice is just like Monokuma. Oh. Ho, ho. Daddy, you're calling me a coward. <laughs> Aren't you going to do something? Yeah, yeah. I just got to do my signature laugh, right? Fuck you. <laughs> There, I did it. What the fuck is wrong with you? He lost his drive. Like a one hit wonder who clings to their former fame. Bullshit, that's all I can say. My head. Listen up, Kokichi. The hell with this game of suspicion crap. I will never be okay with it. 
I'm just gonna believe in everyone. All right. Instead of suspecting my friends, I'm gonna find the truth by believing in them. By the power of friendship, we shall believe. That's why, right, Kaito, you're the man. We will believe in your friends. You can do it. Well, if you think you can win this game like that. Then sure, be my guest. You son of a bitch. Of course I can. I don't need your permission. That's right. How long are you guys going to argue? Let's hurry this up and continue. Right. Before that, I have an important announcement to say. My time of this live stream has now set on a piece. So I'll be ending this part of my live stream right here. Right now, Woo, the cliffhanger is so high, boys. <laughs> I am so sorry if the cliffhanger was a little bit hanging loose. <laughs> but like I said, I'm out. <laughs> I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna lie. No, I already lied earlier. Like I lied to you guys. I lied to you that I'll be streaming until the half of this freaking. Light and I'm freaking thing, but no, I lied to you guys because I wanted to and to have more content for tomorrow's stream. So, if you guys want more of my live stream, you better be sure you guys are on my freaking live stream tomorrow. Watch and say, <laughs> Oh god, but for that, that would be all for this goddamn live stream or the class tryout. Last trial has been postponed for now. For now, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm very sorry for that sudden cliffhanger that I actually did. But you know, whenever you watch a show, there's always that fucking cliffhanger that we all get pissed off. Better get used to it. For now, that's all I could say. Will be, will we able to find the real culprit? On this time on this stream or or is it Kokichi all along who's trying to murder us all and kill us we don't know for sure but for now let's it let it all be done for now right thank you guys so much for watching for people from the live chat thank you guys so much for visiting I hope you love my suffering my voice acting and everything until then, I will see you guys tomorrow. It's your boy, Excellent Tech Prize here, signing off. Woo -hoo! Okay, so thank you guys. Bye, Yonara.